Drugs are broken down into different types of classes according to what they do, such as an antibiotic kills uh, germs. Uh, the types of drugs that I use are sedatives and painkillers. Oftentimes people ask me, do you trank a horse? And I say, well, I never trank a horse because tranquilizers don't work when you're in there doing a procedure. They're great if you want to try and prevent um, an action in the future, such as loading a horse or something that he's scared about. But I would say that um, a sedative is like uh, a shot of whiskey. You know, your nerves are rattled, you take a shot of whiskey and you kind of say, oh, okay. Um, and the drug of choice that I use is xylazine, which used to be called rompum, but it's not made anymore. All we can get are genetics now. Generics. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, uh, the, the rompum or the xylazine does a great job not only in sedating the horse, uh, which is just basically taking the edge off, but also killing pain in the oral mucosa. Often we used to give xylazine for colics. Uh, because it kills the, the pain in the gut. Well, same thing, the gut goes all the way up into your lips. So that's why I use that drug. It's also extremely fast. Within 30 seconds, you've got some sort of pain-killing properties. Uh, another type of sedation is Dormosedan, and I don't use that because it takes forever to, to kick in. And then once it kicks in, it takes forever to leave. And some of these guys feel like they're you know shot off to another planet. And I just don't like that. With xylazine, in an hour you can turn the horse out. In two hours you can ride the horse confidently, and it's not a problem. Uh, the other pain-killing drug I use is uh, butorphanol, which is called torbogesic, and that's a great drug. It's it's like a morphine product, uh, and it just not only kills pain, but it gives a little sense of euphoria. So the mixture of those two drugs really does a, a great job on a horse. Uh, the third drug that I sometimes used and I keep with me at all times is diazepam which you might know as Valium and when I use that is for a horse that's fearful you know the type of horse that you give drugs to and it stands there looking at you yeah you, <laughs> you want to come on and, and take me and you say well this horse needs more drugs so you give it more drugs and now it's looking like a drunk sailor saying come on you want to take me on and then you give it more drugs and it's all about to fall down and it's still trying to fight you because there's an anxiety con uh, concept or, or part in there that the horse is still trying to fight through when you give them some diazepam they say okay I'm yours and you have about 10 minutes of that and and it's most wonderful drug um, to take a horse that's scared uh, and some of these horses are petrified of men and, and vets and I'm both and I'm not going to change either so uh, those are the three drugs I use at all times um, in another video I'll talk about when to use them and, and why I use them